I'm Jared Bendis. I'm an artist and teacher from Cleveland, Ohio, and I hunt castles. Over the next 21 days, we're going to be visiting Chateau all over France to explore French history and culture. I'm standing at the Chateau Pierre Fon. This is my favorite castle. Matter of fact, this is the first castle I ever got to visit, and it's always held a special place in my heart. The Cathedral in Amiens is the tallest in France. This afternoon, not quite a castle, we're stopping in Giverny to see Monet's garden. You might recognize this bridge. I'm standing here in Gizors. That's 11th century fortifications that have been built up over the years. Surrounded by curtain wall, this is as fortified old world castle as it gets. I'm inside the subterranean caves underneath the chateau. It's remarkably cold down here considering how hot it is outside. Before the tourists arrive, before the shops open, the streets of Mont Saint Michel are quiet and peaceful. There are 17 of these enormous towers surrounding the Chateau d'Angers. All right, so it's not a castle, but the dolmen at Bagno are really impressive. The medieval city of Carcassonne. It's extremely windy here up in the Pyrenees at the Chateau de Perpetus. The 16th century Chateau Duc du Joyeuse. The bullfights are running at the Arena in Nimes and it's a festival on the street. The Palace of the Popes in Avignon. The Chateau de Montmaison. Josephine's Palace. It's Napoleon's office. Yes. Versailles, it is enormous. This place is huge. Biggest castle we've been to yet. Matter of fact, it's not even a castle, it's a palace. We made it to Paris, and the first thing we did is we went to see the Eiffel Tower because, well, there it is. Notre Dame in Paris. There's, there's lots of Notre Dames, don't confuse them. So we're at the top of Notre Dame. Well, not quite the very top, but close enough that, well, I'm not going any higher. Gotta be quiet, gotta be fast. I'm in the Musée d'Orsay. It used to be a train station, pretty cool. I have to whisper right now because I'm in the basement of the Louvre at the ruins of the 12th century Chateau de Louvre. These are the foundations of the Bastille. They were found in 1899, dug up and moved here. But this is it, this is part of the Bastille. This may not have been where the Bastille was, but well, it was close. All right, folks, here are the bloopers. The Cathedral in Chart is known for its labyrinth and its beautiful stained glass. That's a film. No, 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 come on up, come on up, we're not filming. Ew. I'm sorry, I just killed something. So can you, is the castle, can you see the castle behind me by the way? <laughs> yes. You can see the castle, like right there. I'm standing in front of, you can see it now. Is it right there? Am I pointing at it? As I have no idea I'm pointing. Uh, there are pay toilets over there. It, the sun is out, it's shiny, it's wonderful. The sun, is, it's shiny. Samu? How do you say it? Samu? Samu. 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 Say like you. Samu. You. Samu. 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 The medieval city of Carcassonne. Arles, everybody. The theater. <laughs> before the tourists arrive, before the stores open, all you can hear on the streets of Mont Saint Michel are the birds and those guys behind me. I mean, this isn't a castle. This is a small town. A small town with a guy who thinks it's time to hammer. Right? It's hammer time. Anyway, let's try this again. Versailles. It sounds like they're building it. I love people. Uh, you love people? Because I love people. And if you don't love people, then you shouldn't come to Versailles. Because it's filled with people. I mean, this place has been packed all day long with people. People just wanting to take pictures. They want to flash on everything. Oh, they actually don't even care what the picture looks like. They just want to fade the painting quickly. Fade, fade, fade. You know what? They should sell spray paint. We would get a spray paint over the things, but that would be too fast for them. I'm telling you, right? Maybe I can pull off a piece for a souvenir. That's what people are really trying to do. That's what this place is about. I mean, there was a sign that said, please don't, don't vandalize the Eiffel Tower. Like, people are going to go, oh, I'm sorry. I thought I could vandalize it, but then I saw a sign and realized, oh, no, I shouldn't vandalize the Eiffel Tower. But here, this is a wonderful place. Now people are looking at me. You know, this <laughs> Bonjour. Anyway, it's Napoleon's office. You can see where we put his laptop. We stopped in saw the Eiffel Tower. We climbed all the way to the top. Well, an elevator took us, but it's the same sort of thing. I mean, we climbed as in, you know, I paid for the ticket. Don't look at me like that. I paid for the ticket. I'm reporting live, live because I made it up the stairs. Let's go. I'm done. 
That's all you get right now. There's your teaser. 21 days in France, you get five minutes of video. You want to see the whole thing? Come on back.